Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker, Dean Hop Realtors. Today I'm coming to, of course, my favorite community, Vintage Oaks in New Braunfels, Texas. Absolutely love this community. Behind me is a model home that's on the market for sale right now. Builders KC Custom Homes. Wow, this is a beautiful home. It is almost 3,900 square feet, four bedroom, three full baths, and it is drop dead gorgeous. I can't wait to show it off. Let's go check it out. All right, currently as I'm filming it, it is March 1st, 2024, and their current asking price is almost 1.3, and when you get in, you'll see why. Uh, this is toward the front part of the community, so this is the beginning of the acre section. The grove section is right down this way, and uh, you're about a five minute walk to the gym. But to be able to get a luxury home and a five minute walk to the gym, lap pool, everything else. And if you haven't seen my video tour of the mini center, I'll put that right up here. And uh, yeah, this is a beautiful home. You just don't see many builders building these long single story homes. And let me tell you, it's got all the bells and whistles in it. Alrighty. All right, just look at this beautiful door we have coming in. Of course, this part of the video where I say hit that like button, subscribe to my channel because it really does help the algorithms. But this door is huge. This one of those uh, pivot doors. So notice the point when I open this door, let me get it all the way open, where the pivot point is. So that's what you gotta do when you have a door this big. But wow, check out the entrance we're coming in. This is super cool, nice foyer. But they put a lot of stone in it and I love how uh, KC Custom Homes built this house. And uh, they, can, they build in the whole area, but it's very rare that you're gonna have a model that comes on the market. They are building a new model uh, in a different part of the community, kind of back where the Grand Endeavor model home is, actually right next door to it. But that's why this house is for sale now. There was a lease back requirement for it, but that lease back requirement is no more. It is just a straight sale. But yeah, just a beautiful living space. These doors open all the way up to the fourth panel. And uh, let's see if I can get these doors open. At least it get out there. There we go, because I do want to show off. It is a beautiful spring day in Texas. Comes with a nice little kitchen area. Metal roof, if you haven't noticed that on the outside. Two fans. You do kind of a neighbor right there behind you, but you've got plenty of yard space back here if you want to do a little fire pit section. And I'll go ahead and walk out. They, they are still, the builder is still using this as a, uh, as our office so we can't go into the garage but it does have a beautiful three car garage it is on uh does have propane tank right there but i wanted to showcase just how big this parking space is out here because yeah you've got your three car garage plenty of parking and then extra parking over here plenty of space to make that little turnaround there's that gorgeous tiger 900 and go out the driveway but this is on a one acre lot and it also gives you a chance to see what that stonework looks like all the way around the house and that beautiful metal roof and i like how they got this little two-tiered yard situation going we have perfect house for doing some entertaining in speaking of entertaining let's head on and check out this kitchen they have some top of the line appliances in it and we did ask the question if the furniture would convey and the response is it's negotiable. So just a beautiful kitchen. Love that big giant island. You have your formal dining room set off to the side, but just like a Perry home, one of their things they like to do is provide that extra storage space down below for if you've got like that, uh, what is it? those big mixing bowls that you don't use but once a year uh, they do have Janair appliances in it which is top of the line it's on par with like the Vikings the beautiful uh, little mini convection oven the microwave and oh my gosh just check out this refrigerator this refrigerator is monstrous 
you do have a six burner Gen Air cooktop with two different sides of the oven in case you want to cook multiple things at different temperatures. Six burners with a griddle and I love the marble backsplash. View from the sink. One of the things I love so much about this house is the balance. Nice single basin granite composite sink. But look at this line going all the way up. Everything is just so perfectly balanced in this house. And I'm kind of silly about that. And you'll see me kind of gush about it when we get to the master bedroom. Pantry. We've got one of those little tucked away, not noticeable pantries back here. It's got some little hidden room. Make sure I get the pantry. Now I think I missed one in my last house. But this pantry goes all the way back. They got that old Casey Custom Homes swag going back there. But lots and lots of storage space in this kitchen. On this side, you've got a little breakfast nook slash could be a homework area, which is kind of neat. And your garage area. I'm going to end up back here in just a second, but I want to show off the secondary bedrooms first. But I do, I'm going to end up, that leads back to the master bedroom. But yeah, just the stonework and what they've done on the ceiling, it's just phenomenal. Beautiful fireplace. And this is a really cute little room. They kind of got it set up as a sitting room. But uh, my partner that's here with me today, she pointed out, I was like, wow, this could be like your little Zoom meeting room. So yeah, you could easily set up your desk right here facing out the window, using this as your natural light, and then just KC Home said the trophy stays, but that's all their trophies. But yeah, you can put your own personal trophies back there. And that's a really cool Zoom room uh, setup. Because yeah, it's the world we're living in nowadays. You gotta have your little uh, video conferencing rooms. All right, let's go back and check out these secondary bedrooms. It's kind of just a little linen closet. This is a the community bathroom. One of the three full baths, mud inset. They got the tile going all the way back there. Super fancy. And I love the uh, design that they did there. And there's a toilet tucked back in the corner. All right, continuing on, one of the, uh, this is a four bedroom house. The three secondary bedrooms are back on this wing. Beautiful floor. Good size closets, but wait until you see the next bedroom's closets. All right, eight foot doors throughout. These bedrooms are gonna be kind of, they will share the uh, toilet, but wow, look at the height of it. You saw the little irregular shaped roof line. It really showcases back in this side of the house. Lots of light. I was talking about the closet space. Each room will have its own sink and this little mini walk-in closet. You got your cowboy boot rack and lots of hanging space. And like I said, you got your own little sink set up. You will share the bathtub shower combination and a little toilet and linen closet right there. And then in the next room, just like that one, you're gonna have a, your own private sink and then your own oh, mini walk-in closet. Very cool. And yeah, here's that other bedroom on the back wing of the house. Super cool, love how they designed this. And I just point, realized like, this bedroom's got the super tall ceiling. This bedroom's got a regular ceiling. Just wanted to point that out. Pick whatever kid your favorite is and they get the tall ceiling room. All right, coming back into the uh, adult side of the house, there's Miss Ceci. Hi. Hi. She's doing some reels and uh, trying to get her to do a YouTube video. We're working on it. Oh, she is gonna do a YouTube <laughs> video today. So I'll put a link to her channel uh, in this video as well. All right. 
Now we're coming into the master bedroom wing of the house. You do have your another little office section back here. So you have your own little meeting uh, or another little Zoom room if you wish. But check out this bedroom. Wow, like a double tree ceiling, just beautiful, lots of space. Once again, still beautiful flooring. Absolutely love it. And I like the little uh, sitting space ever, over there. All right. I talked about this bathroom earlier. Here it comes. We am talk about the symmetry and balance. Check this out. This is just gorgeous. How they did those ceiling, the lights, everything with this uh, soaking tub being like kind of a centerpiece of this bathroom. I love the herringbone uh, flooring in there. And even like the undermount lights in there. It's just really beautiful. And it kind of opens up. And we're going to show you this little private little courtyard there in just a second too. But big, big her vanity with a little makeup section there. And yeah, here's a little sad, his vanity. We well, you know how the world works. But still plenty of space for any guy. Oh crap. Let me fix this real quick. All right, I didn't check into here. There we go. Sorry, poor editing, but there's the toilet without the toilet seat up. Sorry, unprofessional moment. Let's get back on track to this shower. Wow, I mean, this is insane. Look at these shower heads. I mean, you've got two different shower heads set up there. Beautiful tile work. You got your shower rack. I've never had like walk around in a shower, but this also has a sauna built into it. So super cool to have your own little private sauna coming out into your shower. This is such a cool home. And I'm so excited to be able to video this to you guys and showcase it. But yeah, this is absolutely gorgeous. All right. Little extra storage spots. They got it for their coffee setups where you can come out of your, by the time you leave your master bedroom, you're already caffeinated up and ready to take on the day. All right, here comes the closet. Check this bad boy out. Lots and lots of shoe rack space. Lots of hanging space. Even got a little bench to sit down on. But this closet is massive and it just keeps going. And it's got that sneaky need that I love so much, access to the laundry room. You got the laundry room open up to everything else. Their big giant printer machine does not come with the house, but that would be where your washer and dryer are at. And, oh, that was loud. They've got a lock on here. So you kiddos aren't gonna be coming in and disturbing you when you're in adult world. All right, I mentioned this little space right here. Check this out. I mean, there's just so many things you could do with this little open to the sky space. I mean, if you wanted to do some sunbathing, sit outside, have a little cigar time when you wake up in the morning or before you go to bed, whatever your wife will allow you to get away with. But uh, yeah, this is such a cool little quiet space no wind because you got walls on all four sides and this is going into the garage which they have their people working out of so we're not going to go in there but and it's just super cool and then i just had to pause the video because there's people actually checking this house out i'm telling you this house is getting pretty popular more and more people are driving by now that they have reduced the price a little bit, actually quite a bit, and uh, they're ready to get this house sold. <clears throat> this is coming in from the garage. So you got this little mud room, that's uh, just a little storage. Remember they are using this as their office. So we have a few from KC Custom Homes right here, but I wanted to show off this beautiful epoxy floor that's gonna be, they'll convert this back to a regular full garage here when they're moving out. So don't worry about that. They're just using it as our office right now. All right. Just so many things. I know it's a little bit longer of a home tour video because there's a lot of house to video here. But I absolutely love this home. 
Remember there's the laundry room. We showed coming in from the master bedroom and we're back to the study room and then coming into the kitchen area. All right, we are duck dodging and weaving the people that are checking out this house. I don't want to get them on video without their consent, but yeah, this is a beautiful home. I'm excited to see that it's on the market and just tons of space. This house is designed for entertainment and I'm super excited about showing you guys this video. All right, that's gonna do it for this KC Custom Home house that's on the market in Vintage Oaks. Remember, this is almost 3,900 square feet. It's like 3,885-ish, four bedroom, three full baths, and the current asking price is 1.3 million. Okay, they just dropped it, literally $100,000. Anyways, if you're interested in this house, please reach out to me. I'll be happy to help at any buyer. It already has a different listing agent, but I can represent you as a buyer, especially if uh, you're getting, being aware of this video, house because of my video. Anyways, if you like this video, hit the like button. Of course, subscribe to my channel, and as always, share these videos with your friends and family. All right, take care now. Bye.